Hey guys! So, um, weird setup and really dark, but I'm just gonna let it be and see if I brighten it in editing. Long story. But I wanted to get this filmed um, so I could throw all of this away. But I didn't want to make my bed so I'd have good lighting, so I decided to just do it here before. You know, it's fine. It's a new setup. It's all good. I have this bag from before Christmas break of things that I have finished up. Now I'm almost done with a few other things, but I saw this bag and I was like, I don't want this in my life anymore. So I'm going to empty this out, show you what I've, you know, used up, and then hopefully in like a month or so I can just show you what I used up then. Maybe. But this is a really big bag, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. We'll just start with the basics, but I only have two. Well, that's lame. Oh, I have three. There we go. Three makeup wipes. I have these simple cleansing facial wipes. I got these in a free bag from college. They're nice. I mean, I'm, I, I don't know how much simple products are. I know they're not super cheap. They're also not super expensive, so I might buy these again. But I prefer my Equate, um... Beauty Original Clean Wet Club Wet Cleansing Towelettes because I got two of these for five dollars or something like that, and they're sixteen each pack, meaning there was one hundred and twenty, meaning it lasted me literally forever. So, and finally on my makeup wipes, I'm finally going on to my coconut oil, which I will be doing a video on that because I'm actually really enjoying the experience. Is one of them blinking? Don't you dare do that enjoying the experience but I do miss these and I would repurchase these. I have the Bourbon Strawberry Vanilla Body Lotion from what? <laughs> Bath and Body Works. I have yet to finish another lotion. Um, I've been really lazy about putting on lotion. It's kind of hard because I have a watch now and I'm really freaking lazy so I don't want to just take it off so I can rub it all over my arms which I should start doing that and start like using up lotions because I have a lot of lotions and I don't want them going bad. I say that in like every single video I mention lotions in but I finished one. Um, this one had bourbon, villa, bourbon vanilla, garden strawberry, apricot nectar, pink jasmine, and white oak. Will repurchase after I finish the thousand lotions I have already. Next is the Herbal Essences Hydrolicious and Silky Boost Conditioner um, plus Red Berry, Red Berry Rush. I'm, I think I'm also almost done with the shampoo, but I finished this. This, with every shampoo, I always need a lot of it because I don't like the feeling if I don't put a lot in because of how wavy and weirdly textured my hair is. Um, next I have the Endless Weekend Fragrance Mist. This I have shown in videos before. It is four years old. Three years old. Almost three years old. Speaking of old, we have the Germex Vanilla Bean Hand Sanitizer. As you can't, or can tell, I didn't finish this up because the expiration date on this is September to, or 2016, meaning the antibacterial products in it doesn't work anymore, so it, was, it made no sense for me to finish this. Still smelled good, but no, no sense in using this if it's not going to work. So. Next, I really, 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 really liked this. I like the sensation of this. This is the Clean and Clear Advantage 3-in-1 Exfoliating Cleanser with 5% uh, benzoyl peroxide acne medication. Very, very nice. The little beads were very, also very nice for, like, exfoliations. Um, I'd use a little bit of this and, like, put it on my problem areas and then exfoliate there, and it kind of worked. My acne is all over the place. I can never go make it go away, but I can always calm it down, so... Which I'm doing a pretty good job right now, but... I would definitely repurchase this. I loved it. It lasted me forever, but I'm glad it's done, and I'm almost done with my other face wash. And I have two other face washes that I want to use before I can buy another one, but this will be the next one I buy. Next, I have a deodorant. This is the Degree Motion Sense Sex Sexy Intrigue Invisible Solid. It smells good. I have another, or I have a backup, I think. What I'm using right now is a, like, keeps black clothes white, or cloth keeps them from getting white stains, but it doesn't work as well as my, or as these because they're action scents, or motion scents, so I'm going to try to use that one up, and then I have a backup, and I'm so excited to get to the backup because I'm not liking my deodorant, it doesn't last. I have the Olay Fresh Outlast Cooling White Strawberry and Mint Body Wash, 
Smells good. Have another one. Probably won't. I didn't even purchase these, but I probably won't repurchase. Now the fun one before makeup. I have the M-Troll. I'm a troll for nausea and upset stomach. Finished it. Can you tell I wasn't really feeling good? Probably could have used it tonight, but you know, it's all gone. Last two products are makeup. Um, I'm sorry this wasn't as long as I thought it was, but I need to get this trash out of here. My parents are starting to get suspicious. <laughs> so, uh, this, that, and I'm trying to like declutter my room because it is becoming too much for me. <laughs> and that says a lot considering it's a huge room. So I think my goal this weekend is not only to finish homework, but also declutter the room. And I might film it. I don't know yet. This is the Essie Nail, Essie Nail Polish Lacquer in Ladylike, I think. Yeah, this got really old. It's like gloopy. It's really gross. My mom's like, it's probably because it was out in the cold, but this I've had... Oh god, I don't even know how long this I've had this. So it was ready to be done, and I'm working through my nail polishes finally, which is amazing. By the way, ignore my awful ratchet nails. I'm going to repaint them after this video. So the last thing is a mascara. I loved this. I got two other mascaras that I'm actually really liking right now, and um, one of them will be in a review coming up, um, and then I'll just talk about them as a review in my next empties. But this is the CoverGirl Supersizer Fibers Mascara the wand. I don't know if you can see it, but it's just a straight shot. It like kind of tapers out. Is that the word I'm looking for? It looks cool. Um, but I think it started going bad on me. Oh, whoa, oh, that's strong. <laughs> so that went bad, <laughs> but I would definitely repurchase this. Um, I love CoverGirl. It's probably my favorite brand that I have ever found other than e.l.f. I'm really liking e.l.f. right now and there will be a video going up on why. But, yeah, I'm almost done with a lot of products, actually, so I'm going to have a lot for February, hopefully. Cross your fingers. But, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give this video a big thumbs up and comment down below any video requests you guys have. Also, check the description box for what I'm wearing and, you know, other information, where to stalk me and things. And I'll, help, and I'll talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!